Hey guys, Ricardo here. Welcome to another Blog Tech Tips. And of course, guys, today I'm going to look at an uh, issue on the Samsung Galaxy S10. We are getting this here error that says System UI isn't responding. And of course, this is a um, Android system error in which the device interface will freeze up. So, for example, uh, when you're having the problem, you'll find that you cannot um, pull down the notifications area. And of course, you'll have problems moving. In other words, the system UI itself will freeze up and you won't be able to slide through or move through the on-screen options as normal. And of course, the device will just freeze up a bit. You might still be able to go into the app tray, but of course, most of the times you cannot access um, some of the other areas of the user interface. Now, the user interface is all you're seeing. In other words, everything that's generated by the Android um, system itself. Now, if you're having this particular error, I'm going to show you how I was able to deal with mine on my um, device. Now, the first thing you want to do, guys, on this is it applies to any Samsung Galaxy S10, S10 Plus, S10e. All right, so the first thing you want to do is go to um, Settings. Next, go to Apps. Once in Settings, guys, you're going to... Um, Go ahead and sh um, show system apps as the system UI is hidden. So show system apps. As you see, some additional um, settings will appear. And you're going to go down to um, system UI. Now, guys, once you find um, system UI, just go ahead and tap. Then you go to um, storage. Once you're in storage, you're going to go ahead and clear cache. And, of course, if the option allows it, go ahead and um, clear data. Go back. And, of course, you might have to force stop the... Um, system ui and once you force um, stop just go ahead and long press and restart once you do that guys and you come back of course what could happen is that or what should happen is that um it should the error should stop now additionally you can complete these tasks as well to make sure it doesn't come back now um, make sure you're up to date make sure all your apps are up to date especially those um related to um your device itself in terms of stability so go to um settings and under settings go to software update make sure you're connected to the internet and download and install it will check for updates if there's an update it will go ahead and update and of course the system should be um stable as a result of that make sure you do all updates all apps and everything and of course the third and final thing you should do um to fix the issue is you can boot into um android recovery mode and clear the cache partition of course that's a whole other video i have done a tutorial on that i'll link to it on screen and of course the first two or the first one in most cases should fix the issue but of course only attempt the last one if the first two did not um, help all right so the first two shown in this video should be enough to fix the issue and of course give it some time guys it might not take effect right away but the error does eventually go away once you do that and of course if it were to resurface just simply repeat the steps as shown here all right guys ricardo Gardner from blog tech tips saying bye until next time bye